In Dutchess County, a terrible fire devastates a family. It destroyed their home, took lives of two people. And tonight in Millerton, New York, people are rallying around a business owner who's now homeless and heartbroken at the death of her daughter. CBS 2's Tony Aiello reports. It took only one push for a front end loader to topple what remained of the Yang family home in Millerton. Consumed by fire Saturday morning, a two alarm inferno with five people trapped inside. Frank Duncan was driving by and helped rescue three of them. We were able to break an upstairs window and stick a piece of lumber through the second floor uh, in order for one occupant to, to get out. She climbed onto a deck and was led to safety. Two people could not escape and died. 30-year-old Wang Di Tamang and 24-year-old Jenny Yang. Her mother, Amy Yang, owner of Golden Walk Restaurant. Her husband died suddenly seven years ago. She kept the business going while raising four children in the home that was destroyed. I understand there's tremendous affection in this community for Amy and her family. Um, everyone's important to all of us in this family, and it's really sad. The fire deeply felt in this charming village where business owners work to support one another. Millerton is holding a community meeting on Wednesday night, promising a debriefing with the latest information on the fire and an opportunity for people to share what they're feeling in the wake of this tragedy. A measure of the community's support, a GoFundMe campaign already surpassing the $30,000 goal. It's phenomenal. What does that tell you? When something tragic happens, the whole community comes together. A home destroyed, two lives lost, a terrible toll. In Millerton, Dutchess County, Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News. And state police and other investigators are still working to determine the cause and origin of this fatal fire.